Bed bugs are a global issue. They occur everywhere in the world. So one question we get asked all the time is how do you make sure that you never get bed bugs? First of all, there's no guarantee that you won't get them, but there are several ways that you can make yourself a lot safer and do your best to prevent them. Prevention is the best option when it comes to bed bugs and it starts with awareness. Having that awareness, knowing that they could be anywhere at any time, especially if you are someone who travels a lot, they could be on a plane, they could be in a hotel, cruise ships, dorm rooms, um, summer camp if your kids go to camp, really anywhere where there's soft furniture because the way they travel is by hitchhiking on people. So they can hide in the folds of clothing and luggage. So if you have soft luggage, you are more vulnerable to bed bugs. Especially if you think about when you fly, what happens to your luggage? It's all thrown in under the plane with everyone else's stuff too. So let's say somebody has bed bugs and they have soft luggage. Their soft bag thrown on your soft bag, those bugs can crawl directly into your luggage, onto your clothing, and eventually make their way into your home and into your bed. Please do yourself a favor and protect yourself as much as you can. Again, awareness whenever you travel, if you are in a hotel. One of the first things that you need to do is be mindful of where you set your luggage. Don't set any luggage on the floor or on any soft furniture. And you wanna pull the sheets back of that bed. You wanna inspect all the folds of the mattress and all the corners because that's where bed bugs like to be. They like a dark, confined space. Another thing that you wanna do is avoid buying used furniture if you can. Definitely avoid picking up free furniture on the side of the road because that is a very vulnerable thing. That couch may look great, but if you are not able to fully inspect and make sure that it is free of bugs, you could be bringing a huge problem into your home. Also, regularly check your own furniture. Do, do a check maybe once a month, especially if you've traveled a lot. The other signs, if you're not seeing an actual bug, you will see other evidence that they've been there that you're going to want to look for is fecal matter on a mattress. Typically a mattress is going to be white or very light in color so it's easy to spot this. They look like little black specks concentrated all over the bed. Another thing that you might see are the actual shells of dead bed bugs that have been there. So those are all sheds and eggs. Wow. There's a couple of dead ones in there but most of those are from where they've shed. Notice another thing that you might see is smeared blood. So that's, um, if, if you have in your sleep or someone else, if you're in a hotel, in their sleep has swatted a bug off or moved around or rolled over, smashing one of the bugs and the blood being smeared as a result. So definitely make sure you're looking for those things. It's, it takes a little while to realize you have a problem. And by the time that you know you have a problem, it's too late. It's typically at infestation level. What if you were exposed to bed bugs? What do you do? Or if you think you might have been exposed, even as just a precaution after you're finished traveling, one thing that you can do is put everything in the dryer, even clothes you didn't wear. Take everything out of your suitcase, put it in the dryer for an hour on high heat, then make sure you wash everything on high heat and dry it again. So use hot water, absolutely utilize the dryer at the highest setting. Having that extended heat from the dryer will not only kill the bugs, but kill any eggs that might be there as well. So heat is your best method to ensure that you don't end up with an infestation in your home after exposure. If you wanna learn more about bed bugs or any other pest for that matter, make sure that you like this video, that you subscribe, that you follow us on all of our social media because we are constantly putting out really great informative videos and we hope you enjoy.